So Super Mario Party on the Nintendo Switch was a great step in the right direction for the Mario Party series as a whole, but the question still lingers, do we still need a Super Mario Party 2 on the Nintendo Switch? If this is your first time here, welcome, I'm Falcon Zero. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe if you're not already, Follow the Master Sword in that notification bell to stay up to date with videos like this. And with that underway, let's talk about Super Mario Party and if we need a sequel to that game. So something that Super Mario Party went was perfectly in the right direction is they took away the cart. Now you're no longer going across the board all together, which it kind of feels like so friendly when you're doing that. They went back to the brutal aspect of you get to go just one at a time across the board, kind of competing each other so you can ruin those friendships that were friends for 15 years and then they're over because you played Mario Party, which is the way that it should be. But another good thing that Super Mario Party just did too is they actually finally got an update for the online. Now you can actually play with your friends all over the world or just random people as well. I don't know why that wasn't there from the start, but you know, I was glad to know that this game just wasn't ultimately forgotten and they still remember that Super Mario Party exists because the game keeps selling and it's selling really well. And speaking of still, that Super Mario Party has been going in the right direction, they put a great roster of characters in here. I like the dice block aspect that they gave in this game, that every character kind of gets a unique dice block. And all the mini games are really fun, which all that's all really important. And it's like Mario Party really finally took a great step now into the right direction because it was getting a little stale there. But something that they didn't do a really great job on was I thought some of the boards were kind of short. It's like if you got Donkey Kong and you got a mushroom and you just timed it right with the allies, you could really go like almost half the board on like one go around, maybe even a little bit farther. And I just like, why are these boards so short? And not only were the boards so short, there was only four. Only four boards. How did they make this with only adding four boards in the game? And after going through Mario Party, I was like, oh, Nintendo will add DLC and they'll update it. They'll put more boards in it. But now it's been over three years or it's again close to three years and they haven't updated the board. So I really don't think new boards are coming and then especially longer ones because all these boards were so short. But you know what? The N64, the original Mario Party launched with eight boards. I was like, how did the first one launch with eight and then this new one only come out with four? I was like, I don't know what happened. That was the one spot of this game where I really just feel like the ball was dropped. And if they were to go with a sequel, I really think that they don't really have to tune that much up, really keep everything kind of the same as what they had going because they were stepping in the right direction with everything. You know, maybe bring back the orbs as those were pretty fun too when there was like Mario Party 7 or whatever. I, I did like the different orbs in there and they could still keep the dice blocks I feel like as well. But you know, the boards are the biggest thing and I think that this game could actually greatly use a sequel to kind of give it that push and more feel. I was like, if they just did six to eight boards on the next one, more on the eight side, I feel like that would be a great Mario Party and that would actually technically be like the perfect Mario Party because this isn't short of the being a perfect Mario Party. Like it's almost there. Even especially at the online mode is added now, it really makes me think if a new one came out, they would add that online mode from the get go, which would really make it like, that's what we want from a Mario Party. It's so close, but in my opinion, I really think this game does deserve a sequel. We should get a Super Mario Party 2. But I'd also love to know what you guys think. Do you think we need a Super Mario Party 2 or are you content with Super Mario Party? I would love to know. Leave them in the comments below of your thoughts on this. If you like this video, please smash that like button as it really does help out. Subscribe if you're not already. Hit the notification bell to stay up to date with more videos like this. And as always, everyone of YouTube, show me your moves.